Hey, Ryan. Three things before we start. First off, how are you doing? He's eating a zebra cake. <laughs> I'm going to take a bite. Is there a... Uh, I'm doing great sound. now. Uh, well, that's good. Second thing, um, mm -hmm. the reason I'm a level 51 now is because I played this game in between sessions, mm -hmm. and uh, I leveled up, so you guys didn't get to see me open up a loot box. And the third thing is, this is a new session. Uh, we played, we recorded like three episodes of Overwatch, we lost the third one, so uh, we're just, I don't think the goal to get a loot box is existing now, because I'd have to re-level up again, yep. and that's not going to happen. Like, I need a lot of experience to do that. So, we're just going to play, and I'm hopefully not going to try to, I'm not going to suck this time, so that's what we're doing. Ryan got a uh, zebra cake, so he's eating it. <laughs> right and it's, it's like yeah. Tell tell us about the zebra cake, man. It's a normal zebra cake, except it, usually they come in packs of two. Yeah, two and little. This ones, is just right? one big one. And how do you feel about that? How do you, what's your what's your size of zebra cake like? Your review. Um, I prefer. If you had to give that zebra cake a rating out of ten, what would that be? <clears throat> oh, a nine. That'd be a nine, easy. Yeah, Damn. nine point five. Just because it's like too big, you know. We should do, <laughs> we should do food reviews here. Excuse me, but they can't see what the food is. <laughs> we're yeah, just awesome. talking about it. Like, well, well, this is pretty good. Yeah, <laughs> eight, eight and a half. No, I love zebra cakes. Uh, um, but this one is just—it's a lot of zebra cake. I don't think I've had a zebra cake since I was like eight. Really? And I don't. I mean, it, uh, I imagine it tastes just like a Twinkie or like one of those. Oh wait, aren't zebra cakes? Can't they also be like the the black color with the white stripes? Isn't that a zebra cake too? What am I thinking of? I have no idea. I think I'm thinking of a. What's the white one or the black one with the cream in the middle? Oh, ho ho. Yeah, ho ho. That's yeah. what I'm thinking of. Yep. That's um. <laughs> I told you about the <laughs> finding a game thing. God dude. damn it! <laughs> I'll restart. <laughs> I want to. I should know this since like I'm a coming off like a zebra cake connoisseur. I think this is little Debbie, or little Debbie. Yeah, no. I just Debbie. urbanized her, little Debbie. <laughs> What's urbanized her? No, I, I just urbanized her. Oh, or Lil Debbie. Isn't that her name? Oh, it's Lil Li Debbie. Little Debbie. Yeah. <laughs> Lil Debbie in the house? Yeah. She needs to li find a game. Little Overwatch. Debbie. Um, it won't find a game, man. Yeah, I think Zebra Cakes are Little Debbie, and I think Ho Ho's are Hostess. Hostess. I yeah. remember this. Wasn't there, there was a big, uh, con didn't, didn't Twinkies, like, quit, didn't they, like, stop making Twinkies for a while? Hostess, I think. They went. They're yeah. like, we're not making Twinkies anymore, and the world like lost their shit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then people they came are, back. People and were selling lost boxes their shit of Twinkies for like <laughs> four insane. times the amount. Yeah. I remember hearing about Twinkies. that. Twinkies, and we I guarantee the people that bought those, like they didn't, they got them just because, like, ah, look at me, you're right, cool. I'm gonna buy the last <laughs> box of Twinkies. All Even right. though they probably haven't eaten a Twinkie in like 15 years. Yeah, but I don't. I think I've probably had less than three in my entire life. Me too. And I love shitty snack Damn. food. Right when I was about to like do something to entertain us <laughs> while we were looking for a game, we find a game. Traveling oh, you got him? Yeah. Finally. It does it, dude, it sometimes it takes negative three seconds, like you're it like joins a game before when you're not even ready. Mm -hmm. and, and then sometimes yeah, I'm gonna be a reaper. And then some other times it just takes forever like that. We're about to pick pick a terrible team comp just like the other two games that we filmed. So, see the things on the right right there? Are you good? Are you situated right yeah, now? Yeah, I'm good. I'm <laughs> throwing just, shit? No, I'm, I'm, I will forget those sunglasses. So, I'm just trading out my pair. <laughs> he left sunglasses last time he was here visiting, and he yeah. always leaves them on the... What is that? A little counter? Stool Night. nightstand? Well, no, it wouldn't be a nightstand, because isn't a nightstand next to... It has to be next to a bed. An end table. I end think table. This is an yeah, end that's table. a good idea. Yeah, but if you put it next to a bed, then it's a nightstand. We should have... Unless you sleep on the couch. We should hire people just to bring us snacks or filling. This be like, hey, can you give me a uh, in between sessions? Well, bit? no, we we talked about this. If this channel gets big enough, we're just gonna get people to play us. <laughs> oh yeah, do, do our voices. Yeah, all the way up to that. Uh oh. Like if it gets really big, what what actor would you hire to play you? To be me? Yes. Uh, Peter Mullark, because he looks like me. Well, I guess we don't have face cam, so. But Peter Mullark is what's his oh. Josh Hutcherson? Oh yeah yeah yeah. Um. Uh, who who has a voice like mine? No one has voices like that us. That doesn't matter. I pick Morgan Freeman. Oh, that's not fair. Okay, we're going that route. <laughs> yeah, I'll be uh, a, go from nasally damn. stupid voice of me to sultry black man. Dude, when when we first started our gaming channel, people said that we had good voices for this, and I was like, well, that's really? good. Really, I don't I have a good voice, voice for anything. <laughs> I was like, that's what I'm saying. Like, I hate. And my I do voice. a podcast too. And my voice sucks. <laughs> uh, man, you pick Morgan Freeman. Yeah. Who has a good voice? Um, 
my first my mind went to Tom Hanks because we talked about him today. I was like, he has a distinguished voice, but it's not necessarily one you want to listen to over. What's and over more, again. you mean you mean did you mean Ooh. distinct? Yeah. I mean, what's more distinct than Morgan Freeman though? Uh, I don't know. That's what I mean. You have a good choice. Oh shit. I mean, do you want Morgan Freeman? I can pick someone else. <laughs> no, I can't change my are vote. We, are we trading now? Oh man. God damn it! I got fucked up. Uh, oh, how about? Excuse me. Fucking. Mm, what's what's his, his fucking name? God damn it! I had someone on my head, and no, it was gone. Uh, name the movie? No, it wasn't a movie. TV show? Ah, fuck! Who was it? Whatever, it's gone now. I'll just be myself. I suck. <laughs> you can be Morgan Freeman. So you're gonna sit here with Morgan Freeman? <laughs> yeah. I'll just that might be working. worth it then. Yeah. You'll be like, Casey, I can't do this anymore. I'll be like, all right, I'll find someone new, and it'll be like, Morgan Freeman. Like, do you think I, he... I can't even do a good impression, but like, welcome back to the Z. No one can. This is Morgan Freeman. I feel like even if you heard like an impression, a impressionist, is that what they're called? Impersonator. Impersonator. A voice impersonator. Today we are playing Overwatch. Ooh, no fucking. Zenyatta. Sorry, I'm sucking, guys. We have four DPS on defense. We don't have a healer. I don't want to be a healer again. Someone else be a healer. What Maybe. is up with like whenever we're filming Z button videos that I can't like we can't have a good team comp. Oh no, no, no who'd be good if we got Will Ferrell and John C. Riley to come on <laughs> be Step Brothers as the characters of Step Brothers. How did great. that movie never get a sequel? D did you want a sequel for that? Maybe. I feel like. I mean, I. That is true though. I feel like Sequels. that should have been a game that could have gotten, or not a game, a movie that should have gotten a sequel. Yeah. Like, or not should have, but, like, they should have made it, because, like, that's just how... I'm gonna get sniper in the head. Who? I saw you. I saw you, Hanzo. No! Fuck! <laughs> yeah, I guess here. A lot of those oh, no. comedy movies, they don't really need a sequel. Like, I never saw the second Anchorman, but it, I heard it's just the same recycled jokes. Yeah, it was. It was literally like, hey, people like this movie. Let's make it again. Yeah, same thing with, like, All The right. Hangovers. Um, yeah, The Hangovers were, like, literally the same thing. Yeah. Hangover 2 was literally... The same thing. At least, like, three, it was either two or three, but it took place in another country, and it was about one of them, like... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it was, like, it was someone, Stu, I think, was getting married or something. Yeah. I don't know. I can't believe I remembered his name. Uh, there was something I wanted to talk to you about today um, that I feel like it was something you would have been bummed about. Mm -hmm. Gotta kill, bitch! Nice! And, uh... Did you hear about <laughs> Will Smith playing, uh... Oh. God damn it! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fuck! Are you bummed on that? Uh, yeah. I figured you would be. I saw that. Yeah. I was like, oh, Ryan's pissed. <laughs> but, I mean, I really... You don't think he can be a good... Oh, let's talk about what this is. I try to stretch the point. No, hold on, hold on. Let's. Oh, people may not know. Will Smith is being the voice actor for the live-action film of uh, Aladdin. He's being the genie. Yes. Which is who Robin Williams voiced in the animated yeah. movie. Yeah. So, which I feel sorry for anyone that has to take that, has that to, role. Because anyone would have gotten hate from it. Yeah, oh, yeah, of course. Uh-oh. Um, personally, I... I just don't care about Will Smith. To me, he's the same person in every movie. Which he's going to be in this. Uh, God, I, whatever. I mean, I probably won't see it just because I. Really? I probably not. Come on. I don't like. I don't care for Will Smith. Now, granted, I always try to stress the fact like, wait till you see something before you judge before you it. Hate it. But uh, I just, I really don't. No, care Hanzo, fuck about Will Smith. <laughs> Did you um, like Fresh Prince of Bel Air? Not as everyone else, like, not as much as everyone else my age does. Like, I liked it a lot, but I'll, I was a little. But bit I feel younger like it was the thing. Popular. It was a lot of those shows back then. You go back and watch them now; they weren't that good. You like, I don't hold them up on a pedestal like everyone else. It, I think for I mean that was like Will Smith's like start. Yeah, but a lot of the that a lot of that stuff like Fresh Prince, Family Matters. Uh, Full House, like you watched it because it. Was I never on. thought Full House was that good. You watched it because you had no other choice, really. Like in today's climate, with Breaking Bad, The Walking Dead, Mad Men, <laughs> would you really be watching Full House and yeah, Family Matters and I don't in Stranger in Stranger Things? Would you really be watching Full House over Stranger Things? Uh, probably not. Yeah. But still, oh God damn it! No one was on the point. Shit, I would have been on there. I blew it, Ryan. That's just me. Yeah. Well, I guess you're right. But I'm curious to see like what the look of the genie is gonna be. I'm more curious about that Fucking personally. The look of the genie in the live action film probably just super CGI. Yeah. I. What if they just make it? Well, actually, no. No, it said he's just being the voice actor. He's not being the genie. So I wonder if he's gonna do like the mocap stuff for it. Like he moves around. Oh, I'm sure yeah, they'll do it's that. It's all gonna be motion capture. 
The, did you hear? Did you listen to the Nerdist podcast of uh, Tom Holland? Yeah. So you heard about like how they just did tons of motion capture that yep. they could literally make a Spider-Man movie without him even being in it. Yeah, because they just have a bunch of reference. Yes. Yeah. They're like they don't even need it anymore. I think that's that blew my mind. I was like, I never thought they would yeah, do that. Yeah, it's crazy. It's just like how, <clears throat> bitch. Like that's <laughs> film. It's like it's modern filmmaking. Let's just compile a bunch of stock footage together. And that way we just right. have it. Like. We need, do we need him jumping down three steps? Like, yep, we got it. <laughs> we got it. Yep. Yeah, they probably had so much shit, too, for him to just do that. Yep. Need healing. Can we, do we, do we still don't have a healer, man. Uh, so I was following the D23 uh, the expo. Oh, yeah, yeah how was that? This weekend. I mean, I like saw, I was bummed they didn't do the Avengers. <sighs> they didn't show it. Oh, me too. I'm s- really bummed, but I'm so excited. Um, oh! <laughs> fucking drag. <clears throat> I talked about this in the past. I'm a big Disney Parks fan, and it was like... A wet dream times ten. Fucking the amount of shit that they announced. Oh, it was um, great, dude. They fucking uh, so what? What all they announced? They announced Toy Story <sighs> shit. They announced Incredibles two shit. They announced. Well, that's that's Incredibles two. I knew about that. That that was the movie. Which that comes out on my birthday, which is kind of cool. Oh really? Yeah. June fifteenth. Yeah. Uh, not not that day. Maybe like a week <laughs> later. I'll I'll I, I can wait on Incredibles. I've waited this long. I might as well wait until we get like, yeah, a big like group even to go see it. Cars three. Like I'm gonna wait and see that. Just until Redbox at this point. Um, Cars 3? Yeah, it came out. I, I didn't even see the second one. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, that's, it's what, I, that's that what I mean. Like, I heard bad things about it. Yeah, it's, it's not that good. Um, but as far as Disney Parks goes, let me bring this up. Uh, watch they this, showed... watch this, watch this. Oh, 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 I missed every shot! Oh my gosh. <laughs> no! Uh, they showed the detailed model of Star Wars. I fucking got her. <laughs> God. <clears throat> they finally gave it a name, which I think the name's kind of weak. You don't like it? Because for a long time, was, people were just calling it Star Wars Land, which is not that good either. But now Shit! <laughs> it's <laughs> called Star Wars Galaxy's <laughs> Edge. Uh, you don't like that? It's okay. It's okay. It's I mean, fun. that's... I, what else? What I mean, what would you name it on the spot? What do you think you could have oh, named it? I mean, it? I, it's going to be some random Star Wars name. Like... Ri- co- like Coruscant, that doesn't exist. Jedi or Land. Jet what? Jedi Land. No, because it's actually pretty cool. The concept of it. It's supposed to be like a brand new spaceport that you had never seen in the movies before, and like they went and like gave it like a, its own backstory and stuff. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. And that, that's what Disney does with everything. They, oh, everything they, has to have lore. They add, or yeah, add some sort of story element to it. You watch um, this. I'm gonna use my all, and I'm gonna fuck them all up. <laughs> oh. so yeah, that the the Ooh, detailed bitch. model was shown of that, and it just it looks. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> just ran over. It looks mind bending. The amount of detail. It's like a Robo Lionel. Uh, yeah, she can't get up the fucking thing. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're the, are we really not gonna hold this? Come on, guys. We, we have a show. We have to. We can't let these episodes go too long. <laughs> let us win so the episode can end. No. I'm coming, guys. Uh, there's going to be a Guardians of the Galaxy attraction at Epcot. That's cool. Yep. That's Guardians really cool. of the Galaxy? Really? Yeah. Well, they just opened one at Disneyland California Adventure in Anaheim. A Guardians of the Galaxy ride. Really? Yeah. Uh, that's cool. Uh, yeah. What, what was it, what's the ride look like? Uh, the ride, what they did, so they, they took the they Tower of Terror ride, uh-huh. and they just reskinned it, basically. Huh. So it's the exact same ride system and mechanics, but now it's just themed to Guardians of the Galaxy. Hmm. Um, the, they're putting a Ratatouille ride in the France Pavilion at Epcot, which I wrote it. Ratatouille? Yeah. You know I've never seen Ratatouille. Ra- it's fantastic. Really? Yeah. Um, and the ride's awesome. Like I, when I was in France two years ago, I got to ride it there. Huh. And it's like a trackless dark ride, basically. Like it is awesome. That's that's awesome. Yep. Yeah, I feel like I should give that movie a chance. I never. I feel like I'm like really, really good. People guy. reference it a lot that I of things that I listen yeah. to. The guy that made uh, The Incredibles made it. Can, really? Oh, wait, are they different? Uh, hmm. Same wait. Dra- so how many things director. have? How many things have? Uh, like how many different developers do they have for movies from Disney? Oh, I'm gonna fucking dead. Pixar. Yeah. There's a deer. Yep. Oh, there's a baby. There's a baby. <laughs> yeah, it's the baby one that hangs yeah. out. Has spots. I feel like we can, we can't we can, there's no way we can film every time that there's that deer going by. Might be peeing. Is he? Yeah. That's good, good for him. Yep. Oh, look um, at me! Look at me! Fuck him! Ugh! 
I'm being such a good support character. I'm dead. What were we talking about? Pixar? Uh, yeah. Where do the, like, how many different developers do they have for different teams? Like, so you said one dude made Ratatouille and The Incredibles? Yeah, the same director of Brad Bird's. Has he done any other things? Uh, The Iron Giant, I believe. Ooh, that's a good movie. Yep. Uh, he's Man, maybe, on, I, maybe I would like He's worked on a bunch of Simpsons episodes, like, back in the day. He directed uh, Mission Impossible 4. Man, it's kind of like, if you just, if you ever just, god damn it. Let me help. Let me heal you. Oh, nah, I'm not doing shit. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I feel like if you make one good career-making like decision, you can just like that you're set. Like it's like this guy made one good fucking film, and now like he gets hired for a bunch of shit. Like he was in Simpsons, like Disney. That's like a wide variety of things to be doing. Oh yeah. Um, Will you fucking get on the point so we can win? I think the baby just fell down. Did he? Maybe. Poor dude. So yeah, it's exciting. Um, that is exciting. I can't wait. But oh, there's gonna be a Star Wars themed hotel. Ooh, like it's gonna be completely immersive. That's amazing. Yeah. Did we fucking win? Did you come to get out of here? I know, right? That's what this is. Well, about we did sit for like five minutes waiting for this. To start, there we go. So. We won. Sweet. Because I switched to healer. All right. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, with, we're doing a couple more Overwatch videos, and then we're going to be switching to Pikmin, and then, spoilers, we have a new game starting soon this weekend. Yep. Uh, if you pay attention to video game releases, you'll know what it is, but I'm not saying anything. Yep, and then on tomorrow's episode, I'm, we're <laughs> going to talk about the uh, the films that Disney announced. Oh, yeah. Like we're still upcoming. on the... Damn, look at this dude fuck people up. Jesus Christ. <laughs> damn. God damn it. They're upcoming <laughs> uh, the next two years of Disney film releases. Cool. Yep. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good one. Thank you.